Well, I'm here to say quit. If you think people aren't watching your videos anymore, then quit. If you think the topics that you're talking about are the same run -the mill black on black topics, quit. Just quit. You know, if you're not getting your satisfaction out of telling people your stories, quit. The only person that got something to lose out of this is you. Quit. Don't nobody care. Quit. The only person keeping you doing this is you. The only person keeping you making videos is you. If you feel as if it's time for you to quit, then quit. How many people have quit in the past? How many people have quit several times in the past and came back time and time again? So if you really want to quit, quit. Threatening to quit is not going to change anything. People are not going to start watching your videos because they're going to stop you from leaving. Quit. Quit. I'm tired of people sending videos that don't matter to anybody who makes the videos to me anyway. So if you want to quit, quit. Just remember all those people that you were helping. Remember all those people that did watch you. Remember all those people who subscribed to you. So when you quit, you're not quitting on yourself. You're quitting on your subscribers. So... If they're not worthy of watching your videos anymore, then they weren't worthy of watching your videos in the first place. And all these black consciousness videos and all this black consciousness stuff, well, come on, it don't work. You can defend black people as much as you want to, and it ain't going to work. Nobody cares. Nobody gives a damn. I'm trying to figure out how to comb my hair today. I don't even know what to do with it. You know, how you want to do it? Can't do it this way. Can't do it that way. It's too straight on one side and huh, the bad perm video. I'll tell you about it later when it comes out. But other than that, quit. Don't nobody care. So if you topped out, burned out of doing YouTube videos, quit. Erase your page. Get out. Get out while you can. Or you be like me. And a whole bunch of other people got over a thousand videos on YouTube. You know, people watched you in the beginning. You talked all that black shit. But then if you notice, black people will not back your ass up on YouTube no farther than you saying some shit that they can exploit for their own use. In other words, if it sounds good today, it's probably not good tomorrow. I do not know how to comb my hair today. What do I want to do? Hmm? I don't care. Just making this quick video because I'm tired of people get on YouTube, talk a lot of shit. Then when they ain't getting listened to, when other people are burned out, they want to quit. Quit. The fuck out while you can. If you quit, you ain't hurting nobody. You know? But quit. Give up. Everything you work for. It's done. You quit already. Gave up. I hate this reflection on this. I mean, come on, it's backwards. Camera's backwards. I hate that. Come on, I had this mirror right quick. But, um, yeah. You should quit. You should give up. You know, a black woman talking positive without being negative towards black man and shit, you should fucking quit. Because, like you said, nobody's listening to your videos, nobody's watching them anymore. What are you doing it for? Obviously, you're doing it for yourself. You have words trapped inside your body that you have to get out. If you want to quit, then you quit. You want to go back to filming videos and, you know, music in the background that's not yours, pictures on it, and getting your video hits because people like your pictures, then you do that. But... If you found your voice and you're speaking in front of the camera, which a lot of people can't do, then quit. What's the least can happen is you can be satisfied doing something else. You don't have to worry about all the bullshit that you get when people type negative things on the bottom of your page when you're being positive. So if you don't know what you want to do, fucking quit. Quit. Log out. But don't do one thing. 
Don't take your videos down. Don't erase your videos. Just leave. Leave all your work there. Because it's there. You did it and you accomplished that much at least. Leave it there. But quit. Get out while you can before people are calling you a big nose black woman or nigger bitch or whatever the fuck they call black women nowadays besides ignorant. Quit. The only person you're going to save is yourself if you quit. So if you want to quit, just quit. Nobody's going to stop you from quitting. Remember that. So several times I quit. I quit several occasions. And I'm still here. I'm still here to give people advice just like you who want to quit. Quit on Friday. Be back on Monday. Be bitching about everything happened this week. About Wednesday. So, if you're burned out, tired of YouTube, quit. You want to try to find another group of people to be in? Good luck. Don't even have groups anymore. So, you fell for it. They put you in a room for a bunch of black people, and you talked about the black situation, and you're burned out. People have heard everything you've got to say about the black situation. And guess what? You have nothing else to say about it. Do yourself a favor and everybody else a favor and quit. If you gave up publicly loud enough to tell everybody that you're giving up, then just quit. Put yourself out of your misery and get it over with. Go back to doing videos where people are going to appreciate the artistic value of what you got to give because people do not understand what you have to say. They don't understand what you have to say. They will pick and pick and pick. Pick what they want out of your speeches and your conversations and throw the rest away and have you talking about nothing. And then when they reply to you, they will reply in a manner so ignorant, it's disrespectful. So quit. And then all your critics, all the ones that you know you fought to put in their place, then they all win. Each and every one of them win. Every single one of the people who had something negative to say about you that kept you in the game this long wins. So you can quit. You can quit seven days a week, but it still won't change the difference. It won't change anything. You quitting means nothing to those people who will believe, they truly believe, that they're the reason you quit. And when these people have something in their mind that they have caused somebody to quit, then they will come out of the woodworks to prove that they are the reason you quit. So, for those people alone, just for those people, you should quit. Get out. Quit. And the only person that will be satisfied in the end is you. So, you know, quitters never win. And winners never quit. So, you figure it out. You want to win or you want to quit? You want to make people mad and upset because you didn't quit? Then don't quit. Shit or get off the pot. I've told people several times, I'm tired, I'm done with this, I'm quitting. And I quit. And I go to my other page. And when it's time, I come back. Each time, I come back. You got to constantly reinvent yourself when you're on 365 days a week. And that's one thing that I'm done doing. Done recreating myself. Finished with that. You know why? I don't care. My whole purpose now is to make sure people like you who want to quit can either shut up, log off, get the fuck out, suck that shit up, keep on doing what you're doing. Whatever the case may be. It's totally up to you. 
So, from another blogger to another filmmaker to another, do what you do, evolve what you do. never quit doing what you do because if there's a million people out there just like you these people ain't gonna tell you that your video is being watched please for every 10 video hits you get I guarantee you the number is more like five six hundred for every 10 hits you get so when you see your video has been out for a week and you only got 11 hits just remember, somebody has removed your zeros, and somebody does not want you to believe that you're being watched. Somebody does not want you to believe that your videos have any merit or mean anything to anyone. That's why you won't get to hits on the hit counter. I can guarantee you right now, you can take any one of your videos and download it off YouTube, put it up on another place, and within a week you'll get more hits on this other place than you will on YouTube. It's guaranteed if you're not the look if you're not it if you don't resemble you won't get the opportunity you're a black woman you look like a black woman you carry yourself like a black woman thus you will be treated like a black woman in this medium how many black women are partners on YouTube lots of them. how many black women are mainstream without having a g-string up their ass not many. YouTube was founded on booty meat. And what color was that fucking meat? So you take this to heart. You can quit and give up. Or you can fight until they make you quit. See no death threats on the bottom of your videos? I got death threats. I get threats from white people and black people. You think any of these people can make me quit? Please. You people out there are so full of shit that you surprise yourselves. Don't be surprised that you're worth more than what you're portraying yourself to be. Don't be surprised that your worth is much more than what they'll ever tell you. Don't be surprised about anything that you do on this YouTube. You will be exploited. You have been exploited and it don't stop. So if you quit Make sure you erase every account you have. Make sure you download and own every video you've ever made. Quit big. Go out big. But don't let yourself get forced out because you don't think somebody's watching your videos. That sign of weakness. So. For all my fans out there, I'm going to unleash the floodgates. There's several videos that you didn't see of mine that um, will be re-released. As of tomorrow, all 1,000 plus videos will be viewable. My hiatus is over. I will be working on several projects. Being AIX is being uploaded right now as we speak. Thank you for your time. And um, about the lady who wants to quit, don't waste our time talking about something that you know you don't want to do. Your fans ain't going to rally behind your threats. Mine didn't. No one else's ever do. We sit here on this YouTube and we, we, we spill our guts. The ultimate reality show. It's on 365 days a week if we decide to do an episode. Some TV shows don't make it to a thousand episodes. I have 1,200 episodes. You know, I have seven channels. I have one conscience. And remember, you've been tubed.